Go Park Brothers. Go Park We just came from the Plymouth Comic Con, yeah. and it is their first year doing the con, so it was brand new and small as you can imagine, but it was really good. They had a big mix of stuff. They had crafts, um, jewelry, and cool like leather-bound books at the one stand, some artists. Wow. They had yeah. a lot of comics, as you can imagine, uh, a lot of poster prints, collectibles, anime books, jewelry stuff, movies, uh, a few costumers, not many. I didn't stop them. Harley Quinns. Yeah, I didn't stop them to take pictures because they were a few and then I kind of got like... It wasn't that kind of vibe. Yeah, I didn't think it was appropriate, so I didn't. It was smaller. So, yeah, and uh, but it was really nice because you could talk to each um, vendor mm -hmm. as, as you got, you know, as you were looking through their stuff and they had time to talk to you because yeah. it was a smaller con. And I met a guy, this is his first con, he was an artist and uh, I got a really cool print from him and um, what else? I got, oh, a, I got a poster for Guardians. That was pretty cool that mm -hmm. you hadn't seen before. Yeah. And then I got, um, oh, I got my Minecraft character, um, my actual Minecraft character with my skin, like, uh, put on blocks. Um, that was pretty neat. Yep. So. Our son uh, got Guardians, Lego. Oh, the whole set. Yeah. 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 So, for like 20 bucks. And a wrestling figure. Yeah. Yeah. So that was a good deal. It was like three bucks to get in. It was cool. Yeah, three bucks a person to get in. It was so... I, I would recommend keeping an eye out for smaller cons like that so that you can have like a little, I mean, it's not the big event that you're used to when you go to the massive cons, but you get so much more like one-on-one -on -one conversation. Yeah, definitely. Yeah.